everyone, this is Freehandly Made AU, my autistic life. My name is Nisi and this is my channel. Welcome, welcome. I am on my way to the Camp Utmost Women's Retreat for Crossroads Fellowship Church. This is my first retreat I've been on since right after I was baptized at the age of 34. So this is a huge one for me. Um, hubby purposely got the time off from work so I could go without little man they said I could bring little man with me they made arrangements but honestly it would not have worked out well um, okay yeah I wouldn't have worked out well and I was actually going to cancel but he surprised me and got the time off work and said well now you don't can't don't now you can't cancel because I took time off from work <laughs> so you're going basically got ordered to go so here we are and my caravan is up ahead of me now because I got stuck at the stop sign so here's a little bit of the uh, weather going on here as you can see it's kind of dreary and yucky and gray got a little bit of snow flurries going on but anyway I'll be doing some photos and little video clips here and there so uh, possibly video clips here and there um, other than that probably just some photos so until then y'all stay tuned and I'll let you know how this retreat goes for me I had severe anxiety this morning I'm not gonna lie I actually had a headache too so I took some ibuprofen and I got my medication down me and I'm feeling a little bit better I've got all the women's food in the back of my truck to help out because <laughs> they were having some women ride with them and they were running out of room so I'm like we'll put it in the back of my Yukon I got plenty of room I ain't got no one riding with me so I'm riding solo which is how I prefer it because I'm weird like that um extreme introvert going to a women's retreat this should be interesting <laughs> y'all stay tuned we'll talk to you guys soon y'all it's snowing I'm going to a retreat and it's snowing following the car in front of me and I got two more cars behind me in this caravan and we're high up in elevation and it looks like Christmas. It is going to be cold. Oh, it's going to be cold. Well, as you guys can see, it's snowing. <laughs> I didn't bring my boots. Thankfully, we'll be staying inside most of the time except for when we go over here over here over here to the main conference room and where we'll eat and stuff and there's a big huge fireplace in there but behind me that those are our dorms that's our dorms and then over here are cabins you guys will see a picture of that i ain't saying in no cabin <laughs> anyway i probably won't see you guys until sunday afternoon on my way home until then, you guys have a great weekend, and I'll see you soon. Bye, everyone. Well, the retreat is over, and here's a few pictures of the area that we went to. That's our cabin right there. And it's full of bunk beds. That is the other cabins. We actually had a couple ladies staying in one of those cabins, and I didn't even get the chance to ask them if it was warm. That's the conference center uh, where we spent most of our time another view of the cabins that we stayed in my room was on the other side of that building that's our bunk bed I got to roommate with Miss Liz our pastor's wife and we had a good time that's the uh, view outside my dorm window and coming up is where all the magic happened yes I actually met a couple of ladies got two phone numbers this is Nicole, one of our key speakers. I had a little personal time with her. She's awesome, you guys. And this is Miss Candy, our other speaker. She's also awesome. We talked about how God is enough. This was a t-shirt that Nicole gave each of us ladies. It means God is greater than... T-shirt means God is greater than our highs and lows. So, love this t-shirt. And it was an awesome conference. I have a ton of Bible verses to review. And um, yeah, that's going to take me a little bit of time. But the whole conference is about God is enough. And God is enough in all of our circumstances. He is enough. And we just have to realize that and have faith in that and look up. 
Look up in our joys and our happy times. Look up in our sorrow and our times of storms and our bright seasons and our dark seasons. All we have to do is look up. So I hope you guys enjoyed this short clip. I love you guys very much. I'll see you guys this week, this Saturday. In the meantime, always remember, dare to be you, dare to be different. Love from Montana. Bye, everybody.